Alrighty, second time we've tried this mission. We're up on top of uh, Urchin. We've just cleared the bush line and we're heading to Bakaraka. Got two men, two rifles. And Neo the dog. We've still got Waipaki and Rotary Teddy 1640 odd metres. Uh, and after lunch, we'll be heading up there. This is on top of Motu Tere. Marco Rako is that that cone shaped one centre of screen. That's where we're heading. Marco Rako centre screen there. So tomorrow we'll carry on along this ridge line and then cut over to this area and then drop down to the Rangitaki. Tonight we'll be camping down down the bottom there. And there's a creek down there. Looks like somebody someone has already set up down there. And I don't know whether they're a hunter or a tramper. But we'll soon find out. Is up. Yeah. So here's our little setup. So we've got 20 knots southerly coming in there. So it's pretty bitter and cold. There's another hunter in this camp there. He's um he's been here a couple of days and he's spotted a couple of deer. It's got up here. Um, but what I want to show you is just over the hill here. So I'll take over there and show you that. I just had a moment's excitement here. There's, so this is the other hunter's tent down there. And up on this near ridge, just this near ridge up here, there's a big stag that came in and started feeding there. So I went down the tent to tell him, but he's gone out for a hunt elsewhere. Unfortunately. And then the stag's been disturbed and it's moved off out the back. That far ridge is out the back there now somewhere. Oh yeah, that's pretty cool. Alright, just leaving now. Campsite heading up back up to the main range. It's been along, which is the Thunderbolt range, so we'll go along the Thunderbolt range. Then into the wilderness area. 
which is like behind me. And there's a way. Then down to Rangitiki. Um, it's bitterly cold up here. We're at about 1500 meters. Uh, Rangitiki is about 900 meters, so it should be a bit warmer. It was about negative six with wind chill last night. Yeah, wasn't the best night's sleep. Yeah, we're heading up into there. That's our saddle. And we cross up onto that side over there. And the ragged is over there, on the side of that. Saddle to cross over to the next range, and we can find our way up on top of there uh, today. And off again, put down that first leading spur, we think, um, and drop off the end of it. Maybe down there somewhere into the Rangitiki, and that will be our camp tonight at the Ecology Junction. Meters. That's Hayman over there making his way around to the next ridge. Don't drop off the front, just want to go around. It's a little basin around there. Maybe we'll follow this ridge down to the end down there. And then hook around. Uh, I know we end up over here somewhere, I think. Yeah, a hell of a mission up and down, up and down. Just trying to take it easy. So that's the head of Trick Creek right there, is it? Yeah. And that runs parallel to Rangitiki pretty much, eh? Hey? Yeah, it starts from here and wraps around again, it's going parallel. Yeah. Yeah. Gnarly country, but it's good to have some downhill. And there's Ken's, I see there's one in front of us, isn't there? So we've chosen this ridge as our uh, drop off into the Rangitiki. So opposite that big dirty slip over there. A uh, bit of a sharp looking ridge. We have seen a older map from the Forest Service days that has this ridge marked. So that's why we've chosen to use this one. And then we have to go downstream. Uh, yeah, down there, centre shot. It's ecology. So that's our plan to camp down there. Good times, eh? Hell of a mission. Bit of a drink. Got the uh, I use these shoes for walking in the riverbeds. Saves the boots. And then uh, got a few K down there. Hopefully, hopefully only actually maybe 1500 meters. I don't even know. Um, yeah, we came from down up there. It was shite. Really bad. No idea why that massive spade is here, but campsite, we just busted straight into it. Um, pretty well established, looks good. Got a tarp there. Very large spade. But we don't want to stay on this one, we'll just carry on. Beautiful, eh? That's Ecology Stream. Coming into the Rangitiki. 
spæk på. Der er en EU dernede. Cruising around. Campsite's just behind us. Massive fireplace, eh? This is where we're going to camp tonight. This is opposite um, Ecology Stream, where it enters the Rangatiki. So today's mission is to leave this campsite on the Rangatiki Ecology Junction and climb up to the tops up there into the clouds. Once above the bush line we will follow the ridges until we get around to just beneath Marco Rako uh, and we'll camp there. Okay, we just left the Ring of Tiki. Um, we lucked onto the Mangamari sign, old school stuff. And then if you follow up the first ridge, so that's Ecology Stream right there. So, first leading spur. And then there's, you see, center shot where the dog is now. Um, we've got the old tin markers. So, hopefully, this takes us all the way to the top. Still on track. Here's our markers. We haven't lost them. Just making life easy. And our tops just there. 400 meters. Making progress still. Just cracking the bush line now. So now we go up onto 1451 uh, through a saddle. What's the size of the other one, Herman? Yeah, over in that direction then. That's where we came from yesterday. That, this lower ridge here is Trick Creek. We come off the side of there, down to the Rangatiki, up here. drop down over into here, get on that ridge there, and the hooks around to Marco Rako, which is there, the pointy one. Just making our way through the saddle, they're marked with orange tape, and someone's had themselves a bit of a camp down here, made it as a nice fire. Some traveller, just about to push back out on the tussock. That's our ridge line along to Marco Rako. Marco Rako up in the distance, see that pointy one. Uh, so it looks like we're pretty close to bush edges, nothing too hard out. Yeah, saw a deer before when we were dropping down into the saddle. The dog threw up a point um, into this nice gully, but there's plenty of bits and pieces for a deer to hide in, so I sort of ignored it. But then the deer busted out. Uh, it's just a hind, mature hind by the looks. Um, she busted out, but I didn't throw up any shots. Yeah, it's a pretty mean looking country down there, look at that. That just looks like primo long range shooting stuff down there. Looks lush. So good. Speaking of deer, I just spotted one. Just starts uh, probably 200, 250. Down the open, browsing around. 
kind of like shit on its own, but uh, it's in there somewhere. Um, just over the back of that bush there. Just there. Probably center screen. Looks like rubbish, but there's a could be a stag. I'll just have a major through the scope. I might just pop over and have a shot. I've got nothing else to do. Just waiting for my brother to catch up with me. Hang on. When you're ready. Go again. No, go again. Good shot. See yeah. Oh, I picked myself up a deer. Pretty stoked with that. I want to take some meat for tonight, for the dog, for ourselves. Just came down off the main ridge to try to find some water before we bust our ass back up and I found this old camp in here. Someone's been back here a few times. Um, no idea how they would get in there with all these bits and pieces. Maybe out of the Mangamari. Don't know. It's a Mangamari down there, and there's beehives. For the block owners, that's a pretty hard case. So that's our big grind up there, eh? And then along those tops, and then... And then back down into the saddle, eh? Big grind. Um, three o'clock. At least the heat's going out of the day. Mori, eh? Looks like a nice place. The rest of our ridge we've got to walk tonight. So we walk up to that round knob. Uh, yeah, just there. Down the other side of there. So you can see it's all green in here. So and these saddles over there underneath Makaraka. Oh don't go. So we're just going to camp down one of these saddles, either here or there. Tomorrow, that's Marco Ranco. That's Island Range over there. 
this is the headwaters of ecology snowy mountains way in the back there is an established campsite um, it was in the second saddle that I showed you before so there's a tarpaulin here some old water bottle, I've had to use that for the dog there's a stash bucket at the back there with gas cans and other useless rubbish um, yeah, so now we have to find water because it is pretty late, it's past 6 we've been on our feet for 8, 9 hours yeah, where's the water at? Have a drink, girl. Good girl, have a drink. This first part of today's mission. Uh, Marco Rocco is beyond that. Big walk, big walk. That's our first bit, eh? Yeah. the beast up there. Marco Rocco 1727 or something, I don't know, something like that, over 1700. Lake Taupe on the distance. So is that middle range, oh island range is it? The first one, and the back one's middle range eh? Yeah. Huge country eh man, just massive. believe it we're just about to start the final chug up the Marco Rocco and there's a seeker stag just down there chirped at us and then buggered off quite surprised it's high up Top of Makarako. Today we come from those saddles down there. That's all the country we've covered so far. Yeah. Umbrella stand or something there. And that's the way we're going to carry on. So we're heading out here and we uh, drop off into Tamori back into the Rangatiki private block. Another big day, eh? I think it's Tamori. That flat ball picture over there. Just picked up a few deer over here. Try to zoom in. There's one there, there's one up on top, and there's a third one in between sitting down. Oh, and there's one down the bottom, so it's bum stalking away from us. Yeah, it's the first one I saw. 
And you see the one on top, eh? Getting onto this range here now. Uh, the one, the bigger one at far distance. So I think that's, I don't know if you can see it, that one. That's Tamori. And we go to the bald place past there. Drop down into here, which is the Rangitiki down there. And tomorrow we pump up onto that range there somehow. One of those big long spurs up the junction top. Yeah, he's another little dummy. Gotta be deer down there. Deer everywhere, I reckon. Our mark is dropping back down to Rangitiki. Really happy about that. We've come just the last couple of hours from over there. That's Tamori, the ugly lump. Final part of the day. Down to the Rangitiki, and then we're going to have loads of fresh water. Because uh, we've got trouble with fresh water because no. I've been, um, I ripped my drink bottle and then I found a milk bottle that I use for the dog, but I've had very little water along these tops. So really looking forward to heaps of fresh water. This is the camp for New Year's Eve. It's directly opposite the ridge we use to access the Rangitiki from the Tamori tops. That's Ignambright Saddle down there. Uh, we've just come up this ridge out of the bush from the Rangitiki, it looks like we've got Rangitiki. Yesterday we come down that one, sent a shot. It's tomorrow, sent a shot. Come along yesterday, all that range there. Uh, Marco Rako, pointy fella way at the back there. That's where we come from. My bucky hut down there. Uh, we're gonna find a camp somewhere down there, do a little fly camp, somewhere we can sit with the binos and look for deer and then walk up tomorrow up onto the Moo Carry Carry Range, which is that one up there. Our first time I've been here, so we're gonna stay here tonight because it's just too hot in the tussock and you get wicked views out here. We're gonna just sit there with the binos, look around those edges. We're not that interested in hunting, but nice to take a bit of meat home. Urchin uh, Umikarikari track starts over there, up to there. I just had a couple of quick shots from Heyman, who's been out for a hunt, it's right on dusk. So I'm just going to run down the track, see if I can catch up with him, see if he's got anything. Good stuff. Fucking shot two legs in its first shot, threw its back leg in the front leg. Oh, is that down the side of it? It's running away. Oh, yeah. Just shot through two knees at once. 
Got him, eh? Well done. Stuff. Good stuff. Little fella, eh? Yeah. Little um, eater. Where you going, girl? Move it. Hey. That's the scene of last time we were up here. We had a failed micro rocket trip, but we camped uh, over there, shot a deer there. It's way better down this end. A lot better hunting, I reckon. <laughs> 